Alô, nação! Estamos na semifinal do Campeonato Carioca e você acompanha tudo ao vivo na Flá TV+. Agora é decisão. Só na Flá TV+, a transmissão é 100% rubro-negra, com pré-jogo, pós-jogo e convidados mais do que especiais. Além disso, todo o dinheiro gerado com o pacote é destinado 100% para o Flamengo. Cumpre já o Campeonato Carioca na Flá TV+, e entre em campo com o Mengão. Assista todos os jogos dessa reta final do Campeonato Carioca por apenas R$ 49,90. Acesse agora flatvmais.com.br e entre em campo com o nosso Mengão. Eu Lucas Martinez, as pessoas chamam me Lucky Love. Eu sou 30 anos, eu nasci no Norte North Dakota, nos Estados Unidos. Uh, I'd play shooting guard. Uh, I always grew up wanting to be a firefighter. <laughs> uh, it was a lifelong dream before basketball stepped in. Um, so I, I, I feel like I would have been in that route, um, you know, so. <laughs> I started as a young kid, obviously, um, you know, a bunch of friends just playing basketball in the parks and, you know, eventually in high school I was told I could play professional basketball and I went with it and fell in love with the game. I've started in Mexico, I've been in Argentina, Venezuela, Israel, and uh, G League, and now I'm here in Brazil. I have been in a difficult time. I thought about giving up um, actually my senior year of college. Uh, I got into a little trouble. I, there's some things that happened. Uh, you know, it was hard to, after college, to start my professional career, but it's made me who I am and I, it's made me a stronger person. It's made me realize that this moment could be taken away at any second. Um, so I just got to come out here and cherish every moment and take the best of it. My biggest motivator was my mother and my father. Um, just seeing them work so hard. Uh, I have four sisters and three brothers, so um, me, I'm the only one to play a sport. It kind of just motivated me to take this opportunity and do the best I can at it. And you know, they they pushed me a lot. And my high school coach, um, he was the stepping stone. He, he was the one that engraved that I can go somewhere with this game and, you know, enjoy it. The people I admire in basketball are probably Kobe Bryant, number one. I uh, grew up watching him as my favorite player. And then another guy is Dennis Rodman. Um, I love the way he didn't care about scoring the basketball. Uh, always wanted to just rebound and help his team on the defensive end. And I think I do a lot of that as well, but also I shoot the three. So um, I try to mimic my game as Steph Curry. Obviously he has better handles than me, but just being able to move without the ball on the offensive end um, and just, you know, trying to trick the defenses and get open shots. Three of my qualities would probably be shooting, number one. Um, you know, fearless, I have the utmost confidence that I think I'm the best shooter on the floor at all times. Uh, defense, I take pride in the defensive end. I, I love when a player is um, trying to get in the rhythm and I'm there to disrupt them and help our team and get turnovers uh, that way. Uh, and just uh, being a team guy. Uh, do anything for the team anything to help the team win. Um, I, I notice things that, you know, when things are not so going so well, um, I can notice that very easily and I adjust and I, I think I bring a lot of guys together. I 
game I would never forget is probably my high school state championship game my senior year. Um, it was just one of those moments that, you know, I was in the biggest stadium that I had been up to that point in my career. And I think it was just the, the stamping point of what I can do with basketball. And, you know, winning a state championship for my school, my high school, um, for me, that will stick out more than anything, just because it was the starting point. I like to watch Netflix, play some PlayStation, uh, you know, just relax. I like to, when I'm at home, I like to go to the mountains sometimes, um, get away for the weekend, uh, and just hang out with my wife sometimes. And nothing too, too crazy, just, you know, I'm big, big into movies and just hanging out. Uh, you guys can expect me to play hard every possession that I'm on the court, um, you know, and be happy out there with the team that we have and just show that we're a real good family, close knit group. And, you know, obviously um, things are going wrong out in the world, but there's always good things that can happen. And if you stay positive, uh, stay motivated and just look for the brighter day the next day. That's the main goal and that's the only thing I think about is just winning. I saw a key from Mango.